forwards behind, forwards behind, forwards behind, behind, forwards behind, forwards behind. Forward, behind. Forward, behind. Forward, behind. Spread, hard spread. What are you going to do 
the son of strength and back to this position. Turn it back and slow. All the way up, all the way down. That's how it's done. Okay, ready? Up! All the way up, all the way down. No half standing. All the way up. Two! One post winner, so you've got to be no man. Three! Now, all of you are young to do, so there's a problem somewhere, isn't there? Arms out. Sit. Down. Come James. Eight. Up, down. Up. Okay, the other way. Inverted. Another way to shoot your feet round towards the front. Sit here on your back. Let's just go up and in the car. Stand up, lay down. Keep your head up. Otherwise, don't hit the floor with your head. Ready? Up! Take it all the way up, all the way down. Two! <coughs> Ooh, Jackie Chan. All you're telling me is that we need more cardio. Seven. Eight. Don't finish the about it. Stand up, lay down. That's why the sparring is slow. Don't think, react. React. Eight. Eight. Ten. Come on, stand up. Fix uniform. Okay. Good slits. Yes. Uh, 
this lightning, I'll have to kill him. Check that head and the arm. Turn on. Back to the center. All these noises. Music to my ears. Like this. I can offer it in the mind. Okay, relax slowly. Just sit down. Or try to be left apart. Most of you will come in. But that's okay. Once you're there, just reposition your feet. That's good, Jack. Try and have your toes up. Good for a minute. Just try to edge your feet out a little bit more. And then slowly as you go all time, just try to lean forwards or go to set on the floor. Nice and relaxed. You can't stretch the tense muscle. You must be relaxed. Your legs must be straight. Your toes must be up in the air. Only your heel should be on the floor. If you bend your legs to get lower, you're not stretching. Stretch on, just bouncing them down. Okay, relax. And then, what are you going to do? The position you're in now should be like the letter L, in which your back is here and the leg like that. All you're going to do is take your back onto the floor. So your legs should be up 90 degrees this way, and your legs are going to open. The best way I've tried to find to do this is just to put my hands between my legs, with my palms facing outwards. Open my hands till I find some part of my leg that isn't behind the knee, because you'll bend the knees, and just press. If you can pull your legs back and down, that's always so good. But the emphasis is on keeping your legs straight. Go. Good job. Try to open your hands a bit. Away from your knees. <coughs> so the last place you want your hands is anywhere near the back of your knees. Have it on your thigh or your lower leg. Don't touch your knees. Quite good. Stay. Make sure your back stays on the floor, though, James. From your belt to your head should be on the floor. Everything else should be on the air. And slowly relax and stand. <sighs> Good once you're up, circles, hands in your hips, do the hips in the book. Stand 
چی رو درخت کنی چی رو درخت اوکی هم شایفت خود این رو دیو از مورد تو وان یعنی سو می روست آفتا رو باید که بعد یاش پانه مورد شایفت یه باید یوز بیدن 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 So we'll go in grade order. Dave's going to kick first, Paul's going to kick, then Sam's going to kick. Anything you like, even just one kick. We're trying to keep it as if Maggie's hand. So what we're going to do is throw a kick. It's sparring without contact. But the aim is to get faster and faster. Yeah? Um, if there's any hazardous areas, you can just pull the walking hazard, then just avoid it. There's no clean material to jar the walk for. Uh, the aim is speed. Yeah, ready? Go! Certainly, uh, Dave's going for red belt, and red belt on the boat, even one for one is contact. So what I want to do is to just, just spar. Those of you that can't kick high, you kick to the body armor. Uh, but still, try to touch with all your kicks. I'm not saying only do high kicks. Uh, certainly, if you can touch people's faces with control, then do that. If not, you touch the body. It is still sparring, but it's not about points. It's about trying to touch with the, the windiest kicks you know. Ready? Go! Yeah, 
rest. John? Oh, that's right, Halloween. Yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That's on my soul. That's two so far, isn't it? You've got to be on the tech and you're right. And you've got to go to God. One time to go. And then, in and out, no, 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 no. In and out. She can get out of the way there.
step back kick. Everybody else, axe, axe, slip back.
sure it's on the red bit, yeah? or you'll get this. It'll either sweep or it'll go low. Lots of people in this cup can it kick low. Right, but otherwise, here, down, and up this way. You can kick to there in competition. You kick someone hard on the face and knock them out if you don't kill them. Don't do that in the pass. Hit the pad a bit. If you want to put the beast heavy in, then jump from that to the few. Otherwise, just step and jump this way. Go. And slip back in. Land, then jump. Land. Oh, 
later talk a little before. Uh,
Mr. Lawrence? Tip? Okay. What's up? Stand up! Front. Front position. Okay, from here, try this. Throw up the knees. Just relax. Does anyone know what a raised hand is? The right hand is this bit, from the thumb to the back of the thumb. That strike. Here, here, press up. Okay? Just try 20 of those. Ready? Go! Okay. Come on, strike hard. Raise hand, not on your thumb. Raise hand. Come on, try hard. Just try ten. If you can do ten, then stop. Come on, try. Some of you will have to break the this pretty soon. From here, if we do this as a press up, then also preparation for palm here. If we do this, obviously preparation for punch. Here, preparation for wrist hand as we've just done. This time, back of the hand this way. There isn't a strike with the back of the or the lower end of the arm, but there is a block this way where you block up this way. So, have your palms down here. It may help you to make it fit, but that is easier, so you find it comfortable for you. Here, up, down, up, down, up, down, this way. Just try 10. Ready? Go! Up, down, up, down. <coughs> Don't wait. Up, down. Please relax. Okay, two more. The last one being what well, might look like an eagle's claw or something, but really it would help to strengthen the spear hand. So open fingers this way, press up position, up, down, up, down, up, down, this way. Just ten. Go. Uh, and it becomes a game 
The first time you go to a competition, you'll be trying to knock people out. Because you're nervous and, oh my God, he's going to kill me. And you're trying to get in there first. Once you've been to a few and all those nerves go, uh, I can see it when I swallow some of you now. You're all tense and I don't know what your problem is, but uh, you think someone's going to kill you or something. But it's just a game, particularly in class. So the more you can play with each other in that game scenario, um, if Paul catches me in the face, I go, oh, good kick, and then carry on playing. Or if I catch him in the face, carry on playing. No one's starting to hit anyone. Um, and it's just, it's just playing. You don't get hit. That's what you do in it's sparring. No one can't get, can't get touched. I can't remember the last time I sparred with even Tom and not got kicked. Everyone gets kicked. If you didn't get kicked, you wouldn't be betrayed, would you? A Superman or something. Yeah? So, uh, Tom well in there. Um, everyone gets kicked. The only thing you have to do is not be put off by it while you're sparring. <coughs> the two things, the two reasons you'll be put off by it sparring is if your ego is bigger than your capabilities. And for the next 10 minutes while you're sparring, you're like, oh, we don't have kicks. How dare he kick me? Because you're not used to being kicked. But everyone gets kicked, so I can't see it being that. The only other one is you're thinking, why did I get kicked? What could I have fixed there? What should I have done? Um, and if you could block every kick all the time, then you're too good. And I don't know anyone that good. I call my instructor. I call Master Davis. Then he kills me. Yeah, no one spars all the time and they don't get touched. No one. No one at all. So with that in mind, you can play together now and not let ego get in the way, or I'm going to kill you, or I'm going to score more points. Go play the game. Ideally, you wouldn't kick to the head if you couldn't control your foot. Sometimes they may run on, and you would have controlled it if they'd come on too quick. Um, or you've gone forward, and they've come forward, and you both hit. That's an accident. That's not ego or anything like that. Because the next time you go to kick each other, it'll be back to happen, and that's the game. Uh, so we wear protective stuff just to give us something to do. We could wear head guards as well, but I think it just gets in the way. Unless you're in a competition, you don't really need that. Um, you should be able to touch the people's head without them dying. I, Paul kicked me before, then I kicked Paul, and we're both still standing up. So really, you don't need head guards that much. Tom boots me around all the time, and I don't wear armor, and I've never gone under the bruise. So it's all about just playing the game. Is that clear? Okay. okay. No questions. Ted it? Is it your brain? Do it. Come start and do that? Come start and do that. Okay, thanks for coming. I'll see you in Southport 7. I'll see you in Southport 7.